Okay guys, so on this tutorial I'm using F sharp minor scale, I'm on 170 BPMs and now I'll just start to add some chords to get that sad feeling. Um, either F sharp, D, there are some good keys to start with, you know. So now um, I will put one octave up on this middle middle key so the melody can go like it could be fuller bro. Altes like to strum. Now I'm add some uh, a little variation on, on the second part though. Now I'm ahead like a top line melody. So this is the full melody right here. 
as you see like I had like this little I messed the velocity going down and also it's like a, kind of a delay feeling you know on each key separately separately you know so it gives like you know what I'm saying like that's the vibe bro I just said a little difference here on the on the hand. Okay, I may add just like uh, some little keys here on the, on the hand of the melody, so we can make it like fuller. Okay guys, so now I will copy the same pattern of the piano to Omnisphere bell sound that I like so we can make the, the melody with more energy and with more dynamics, different sounds and, and stuff, you know? So I'll just copy the exactly same pattern. I'll take out like the, the root notes, the bass notes right here. bring down everything one octave and now I'll just EQ it a little bit so uh, the piano melody and the bell the bell melody don't crash with each other no some reverb Okay guys, so we have the piano melody with the bells, now I'm gonna hit the trumpet and see um, if it works on these melodies or no, but I think it will, will be fire right now. Okay, I think this would work better. Um, 
Okay, this is the way, let's get it. Uh, it's sounding right now so uh, I'm probably adding like two more layers and the melody is done okay guys so now I'm gonna add uh, these uh, distant voices from arcade um, because like with some vocals on the background I think would be perfect for this melody Yes, sir. Haha. <laughs> Let's do it. Okay, guys, so now I'm gonna add uh, these uh, distant voices from Arcade. Um, because, like, with some vocals on the background, I think would be perfect for this melody. Yes, sir. Haha. <laughs> Let's do it. Okay guys, so this is how the, the full melody sounds like. 
After this, I'ma pass it to Jet and he's adding the drums on the beat. He's about to go crazy, this one. Okay guys, so this is how the, the full melody sounds like. After this I'ma pass it to Jet and he's adding the drums on the beat, he's about to go crazy this one. What's up guys, you guys already got the introduction from Susek, I'm just going to let you know how it goes. He sent me these loops, we're going to play them out, we'll see what we want to do with them. I already laid out some, um, I already laid out some drums that we could go through. We're going to put those on the track and we're going to just basically from there on uh, lay it out and see what we come up with. So we've got, you know, the full loop, the piano, the bell, the trumpet, the voice pad, and then the synth bass all sent to buses already. So I'm going to let you guys hear the main loop first and foremost. Here you go. So beautiful. We're going rod wave this time. So I'm going to try to mix in a little bit of the, you know, standard rod wave drums, but try to throw our own little like rain kind spin on it. Um, we'll just get right into it. So I'm first thing I'm going to do just hearing this is I'm going to take the main melody and I'm going to pitch it up to semitones. Okay, cool. Uh, I think I'm going to create the main stuff off of either the bell or the piano. I think I'm going to work off the bell. So let's get right into that. I'm going to start with the 808. So far. as a start. We'll play with that a little bit more. Good start. Okay, that's fair enough. Give a little stereo image to it. Let's create a verb bus. We'll go right in. 
into the hi hats. I'm gonna do like, um, you know, your standard hi hats with a little bit of a, a variation. Just we'll see what we we come up with. Do a little. I think I'm going to do that and then I'm just going to do the standard two step like when it drops into the verse. And then I'm going to take this one, I'm going to do four step with it, and then I'm going to do that like that like shake bounce or whatever. Or I drop it and then I think I'm gonna like maybe do some like more variation in it. Like that, and then I'll delete these. See what we come up with. Okay, okay I like the pattern, but I don't like the sound. Yikes. Hat open. Do some like hat slides. Mm, I like this hat sound. Okay. All right, let's play with that a little more and then we'll go back to the 808 kick and finish it off and then um, arrange it. Have the pickup like that. I'll play with the pan a little bit in this. Have this one from here, this one here. Like that, everything seems to be in agreement. Okay, so I like the the, the notes are right and we're in the right progression. Now we just gotta find the right key for the sample to match like where we like the 808s to hit.
Later rate's like a little low there, so like if I pitch it up three, pitch this up three. Are we gonna still like how everything even sounds? very different. Okay guys, we'll be back. I'm going to finish this uh, out. I'm going to play with the drums a little bit more and we'll be back with arrangement and some of the other stuff as well. All right, y'all, welcome back. Um, what I'm going to do now is just basically just get the drums all up to to like, like max clipping, max loudness, and then I'm going to Lay out the beat, arrange everything, and finalize a couple of the sound selections, and add a couple of effects on some of the melodies. So, this is where we are. Lay over some of the other stuff, like the, the voice pad, and mix in the, the synth bass correctly, and the trumpet, and all that stuff. So... It's already got a good amount of reverb on it. It's one. Oops. That is not. There we go. Some arrangement. Let's do the fun part. Make sure we get this all right. Arrangement time. All right. I think we start at best with 
probably like this. Give it definitely want the trumpet for sure. I want the synth bass coming in right there. Okay, let's let it drop. Take out that. And the only ones we need off the bat are going to be, we don't want those. We want, we want the simple drums first. No kick. Kick comes in. Hi-hats will come in on the verse like that. Trumpet. This guy's going to be our last 808 pattern. Definitely don't want our kick. Where's our kick? Pull it all back to the clap. Then we do our kick comes in here. Our 808 joins in. Right here. Let's do some fine tuning, final touches. Really get it to where we want it to be. Automate it for the verses. So it'll be high energy on the hooks. On the verses, it'll be a little bit more tame.